guy that guys just a quick heads up um my channel is getting a huge update because starting today I am uploading daily the game you're about to see is a horror game so one day so today it's gonna be a horror game tomorrow it's going to be a fortnite clips or something I don't know it'll be something other than horror the next day it'll be horror then the next day it'll be something else other than horror so basically every other day so basically it's going to be daily content every day um so yeah i'm um, looking forward to that hopefully this helps my channel somehow some way i don't know but anyway um enjoy the video uh yeah hey what's going on everyone my name is supernova reaper welcome back to notes of Obs of uh to notes of obsession now a lot of you may not remember last time I played this game and that's okay because it was a long long time ago well maybe it was about I think maybe okay maybe it wasn't a long long time ago but it was I think at least a year ago I played this game on stream but I don't think I got very far on it and I don't think it saves my saved my thing my stuff so I'm gonna just read how to play because I don't really remember so E is interact W A S T is yeah whatever crouch okay uh right yeah okay uh, wind up music. Left click is wind music box, and right click is toggle music box. All right, I'm happy I read that because I do not <laughs> remember the controls. Prologue. Harriet was not happy at all since her husband was out of town for was out of town for work. She had to pick up Michael from hockey practice. She would much rather be at home taking it easy after a hard day at work. When Michael was finally ready to leave, Harriet was ready to yell at him for taking so long. As as they got back home, Harriet found a nice surprise waiting for her. Her husband had sent her a package from his travels. He always knew how to cheer her up. Inside inside was a music was a beautiful music box with an inner with an intricate Russian design. Feeling her eyelids grow heavy, she set aside the music box and decided to rest for a bit. It had been a long day. She definitely needed some sleep. I'm bad at reading. At reading. But, as, I don't know, that's weird. So let's just go ahead and get right into the game. Now, here we go, yeah. Also, I'm sorry if the, okay, I'll just shut up real quick. Okay, so also, I'm sorry if the audio isn't the best because I don't really have any way of testing it right now, so, yeah. Okay, that scared me. That's good. This house is nice. I want a house like this. I really do want a house like this. Okay, maybe no. Maybe I don't because this house is like has like a monster in it or something. So yeah. Hello. Anyone to home? Anybody at all? It's kind of hard to tell what you can interact with in games like these. Locked. Yeah, we just keep all the doors locked in our house, don't we? Okay. Um. So I think I have to go upstairs. Because again, I had I have played this, so. No. No, I'm good. No. 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 I pick up that music box and all, all bad. No. That music box is bad. How do I leave? Where's the front door? I just want to go. Just go back to sleep. Harriet, just go back to sleep. Come on, Harriet. Just go back to sleep. I know you want to. But you'll float himself. What you mean? Alright. Well, guess I gotta go upstairs or else I'm not gonna be able to progress the game, so. I gotta provoke the demon that lives in my house. That's basically what I'm doing. Also, can I open that back? Because if I could, that'd be great. Also, my chair fell over. I thought that was something coming up behind me to get me. I that scared me. I'm not gonna lie. Alright, let's just go up here and get this music box. Mm. Okay, it's all good. We're okay. We are okay. We we are fine. Oh, wait, didn't I have my kid with me? 
Where's that kid? Is he not in here? Is this not his room? What? The Glada. I know, that's a different language. Or is this my room? No, there's no way this is my room. Hmm. Oh, but yeah. This is gonna be a jump scare. I think, maybe, I don't know. Okay. Oh, that scared me. I, I thought there was gonna be a jump scare. But there wasn't. Toggle the right mouse button to open the close the music box. Wind that baby up. Those didn't like symbols. All right, yeah. I'll beat you with this music box. Don't think I won't. Catch his hands. <clears throat> don't do it. Yeah, we got it. You don't. Hey, we both don't have legs. Let's look at that. Neither of us have legs. You good? I don't know. Um. Oh! What? Of course, all I had to do was look away. That scared me. I thought that was a symbol I had to get. Is there anything in here that I gotta get? Anything in here, like, at all? No. Oh, I forgot. This is like PT vibes. I forgot. Oh, that door. That door shows the. Symbols that you get. I want a room like this, just not inhabited by a demon. You know, like I want this house. Just I want this room just without the demon. Here we go. There's one. Oh. I don't like that. I really don't like that. Holy crap. Alright, let's go. Anything here? No. What? I don't, care what, I don't care what anyone says. I'm staying here. Okay, I won't. Mr. Elephant, was it you? Oh, you little, you little bugger. Oh, what did you do? I just crouch. Why do I have to crouch, huh? Okay, yeah, let's get in here. I, I like it in here. I think I feel safe in here. Yeah, right here. I'm gonna hide right here. This is I'm staying here forever. I don't care what anyone says. I'm staying here. I'm not leaving. Nope. Mm -mm. There is nothing that you can do to convince me to leave. Oh, I'm good. I'm gonna just hide here forever. No one needs to know where I am. I'll just have a new name. Have a new. I'll live a new life. Mr. Elephant, why are you looking at me? Mr. Elephant, I don't like that you're looking at me. Because you were just facing the door. Are you following me? Oh, I hate this. You stay looking that way, buddy. You stay looking that way. I don't, I don't have anything to do with you. You are not my problem. And I'm not yours. What? What was that? What happened? Who, what, when, where, why? What? 
Where's this last symbol? Oh gosh. Enga that that. Like Not really too sure what language this is in, but I don't know. I don't really care either. Nightmares, hold, behold me. Oh, door's open now. Huh? Whoa. Why is it normal, huh? Why is it so normal, huh? Okay, I'm gonna be real with you real quick. I don't like this. Like, I love horror games, but I like watching horror games. When I actually have to play it and make the decisions, it's a lot harder to do than just watching and getting scared. Actually playing and getting scared, a lot more difficult. Especially now that I don't remember what happens past this point. I'm a little scared to find out because this door's locked. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it so much. I'm going to go back in here. Something in here I have to get. Uh. <laughs> Guess who? Oh. Oh my. Well, that just happened. Did I get kidnapped? Oh, no. No, no, no. Oh, yeah. For, oh, no. I find the symbol, then that thing comes after me. This is where I got stuck last time. Oh. Ah, okay. Can I save? Is there is this a save option? No. Uh. Oh. <laughs> Hello. I don't want to do this, man. Why did I have to come back to this game of all games? The one truly scary game. All right. Well, I hear the symbol. The thing comes after me. What did I tell you? I wonder if that thing kills me if it's is a game over. I really hope not. Okay. Walking around my haunted house, looking for symbols. For some reason I don't run away. So I would probably run. I 
really expected that thing to just come running out the door. Guys, I'm gonna be real with you. I can still hear the game, but I don't have my headset on. I'm a little scared to put it back on, and I'm a little scared to leave this room because that monster thingy should be out here now looking for me because I got a symbol. So, I can hear the game. But I don't have my headset on. Is that cheating? I really hope it's not cheating because I don't want to be spooked that bad. Okay. And I think that thing had like a terrible design. Like not terrible as like it's bad, but like it was spook. It was spook spook. <sighs> this is this is where I I cannot do games where I have to go around a house or a building. While there is something else wandering around looking for me, I cannot do those types of games. So I might not be able to finish this game because, like, uh, yeah. Here we go. Stop you. Haha, <laughs> whoa. Oh my gosh, it doesn't stop. The game doesn't stop when you pause. Oh no. I can't do this, man. I might actually have to stop playing. I'm like freaking out. Okay. Here we go. Is someone in here? Monkey, giraffe, elephant. There's two elephants out out. So, I have made the executive decision to keep my headset off because I, it's a little spook. It's a spooky. Oh, I can't, man. <laughs> this is just playing with me, man. I can't, like, the reason I can't, I hate these types of games where, like, you have to walk around while something's looking for you is because I always. I have a rational fear, or irrational, I don't know, that whenever I'm alone, there's always something out to get me. That might sound dumb, and it is, but I just, these types of games really mess with me. Especially when I know that, that, that what's, I know what's after me, and don't want to move from the spot because I for some reason feel safe here. I'm just waiting for that thing, the thing that's trying to kill me, to walk around the corner and just charge me. Oh, I can't do this, man. Oh, man. Okay. Whatever. Let's just go. Yep. That's what I say. The thing's after me now. <laughs> yep, there it is. There it is. Okay. Let me 
Okay. I was gonna power through this game. I was. I was like, oh, this isn't gonna be that scary. It can't be that hard. The game can't be too bad. Oh, but how it is. This game. I forgot how much this game messes with me on another level. This game plays with one of my biggest fears. And again, it's a dumb fear, I know. And it's a dumb reason to be scared of a game like this. But what makes this game worse? What makes this game a lot scarier than a lot of the other games to me is the fact that you feel so hopeless that whenever you're caught, whenever that thing sees you, you have there's a feeling that you are just done. Like you're there's no returning. Like you were just done. You're dead. You might as well run into the thing head on. That's not all though. The other the other reason this game is so much scarier to me is that monster's design. Now it's not the worst, the scariest thing in the world, but just sitting there, walking, and then, because when I heard, because again, I could still hear, just not as loud, but I w when I got that, um, when I was moving back to the closet, and I heard that thing, I was scared, and I did not want to move, and my brain was like, no, stay, you're not moving, if you don't move, you'll be safe, and it, I almost was, I thought I almost was. But then that thing was like, oh, hey, I see you. Ah! It killed me. So, yeah, uh, sorry about this. I know it's kind of an, an anticlimactic ending to a game like this. I might come back to it later. I might not. I don't know. But, um, anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it, be sure to like, subscribe, comment, hit that bell icon after subscribe. Because guess what, guys? Guess what? If any of you made it to the end of the video, guess what? I am... Um, yeah, uh-huh, so anyway, 